Um, when I first heard about sacred geometry, I thought it was going to be really complicated, um, like over the top. With I just thought it was going to take me weeks to understand. So now that you've had a chance to go through some really fundamental um, practices, how do you feel about it? And basically, there. Yeah. Oh, well, now that I've you know seen the process, or uh, at least a part of it, I'm actually really inspired and excited to get some of these things into my artwork. So. Yeah. Well, speaking of your artwork, how do you see integrating what you've learned into you know what you will do in the future? Well, now I think that I'd probably integrate this by maybe my cultural side. You know, we just we have so many colors in the Mexican culture, so I think I'd go into something like that. So the drawing that you have created, mm -hmm. um, can you talk a little bit about your color choice and the structure and um, if there's anything that's inspiring the choices that you're, you're yeah. using to make it? Well, I kept it really simple. Um, I didn't want to overwhelm myself, so um, my color choice, actually, I'm really into bright colors. I think that's mainly influenced by my heritage, so that's why I chose these colors. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm.